Hi everyone, welcome back. Today is will be my skincare routine and my daily like style of my makeup that I do. I rarely wear makeup, so yeah. But let's get right into it. Um, I'm gonna use my hairband for my. <laughs> I don't think I put that on wrong, but to put the hair back and then start. I'm gonna use my PR products for my skincare I usually hold up does that even look right <laughs> I don't even know but oh well um I am a big fan of two other serums that I've used uh where's the other one I want to show the other one so bad there it is so really my skincare my original skincare was the CeraVe hydrating toner but I ran out um for serums, I use is the Tora and Divin Serum and the Beauty of Josen's Glow Deep Serum. But I took a break on it. It's basically hydration, moisturizing your skin. It's really good. It didn't affect my skin. Then my night cream or night moisturizer is the Kors RX Event Cell 92 cream that I used to use. Um, I did take a break, but I still have a lot left. That's good. And then for my daytime moisturizer is the Cetaphil Daily Facial Moisturizer uh, SPF 15. Of Cetaphil, but my new ones for my PR. See, is that all they sent me? I think that is. It. I'm gonna make sure. But my PR that's, that they sent me, sewn by me. Um, I've been recently loving is like the toner. It's the A H A B H A P H A 30 Days Toner. I love this toner. It smells like a green tea tree. So it smells like. I do like is this. Um, we call this the sunscreen it's like really good it's smooth when you put on your skin it doesn't leave a cast or anything i really like it i've used it like three times then the serum they sent me was the yuja niacin anti-blemish serum it has yuja extract and niacinamide in it but it's really good i don't really have blemishes but it is um to brighten it can brighten your skin so yeah and then the last one is the aha bha pha um 30 days milk cream this one has scintilla Asi asiatica and tea tree in it but it's really good but i'm not gonna use sunscreen today because i'm not going outside today um it's kind of cloudy today so yeah but for now let's start on by doing my skincare routine like every day i do try to use my skincare products like every day but some days i don't like i just wash my like wash my face and put the toner on and just go i know that's kind of crazy kind of lazy but kind of crazy and lazy but i do sometimes do that because i feel like this toner itself is hydrating on my skin like and i don't need anything else but and at night i usually don't put none on my face because i don't want to feel like my skin's heavy but with this stuff this stuff on my face just feels like light so i do try to put on the toner and the cream not the serum as much. I like using the serums in the day. I don't know. I just do that. Gotta get in those T-zones. I do sometimes use one cotton round because I feel like that's enough for me. So, yeah. Um, I really use my hands because I feel like my hands have so much germs. I'm like, ew. But I did use my hands on my old toner that I had because it was like easy. But what I love about this toner is that the little spout is so easy to like, you know, push, like get the stuff out where the CeraVe one, it like pours out, like, bro, seriously. Seriously. Next I'm putting on is the serum. I do this sometimes once a week. I don't put a lot on. So, yeah. Okay. And then put it on this side of my cheek and my chin I'm gonna let it dry first because why not okay that's finished don't mind I have a little bump right here but that's not from the skincare because I like to get a whole week where I didn't do no skincare some days I'm just like, oh, where to go? And I forget <laughs> that it's like right here. Cause that's my little jewelry vanity thing right there, like where my storage is. And I just 
take the bin like this is the this is the bin of all my stuff and i put it like right on my desk sometimes i do forget doing that so i gotta keep up with doing that every like every other day or every day so yeah so um yeah those are done the last thing is this one the miracle cream hold up there you go this is like so it's so cooling like i i love it so much it does brighten my skin and like has helped with my tan because when i was in the swimming pool my face tan my back tan my legs tan um so like those are like going away slowly but yeah it's taking its time but today um this whole summer was crazy with the weather like super hot heat last night we had a huge storm slash it was a tornado watch or flood watch but luckily nothing happened here but everything's fine maybe other parts is not as fine <laughs> because the wind was very powerful and the wet the rain was beautiful like i could hear it in my window like splashing against the window it was like so pretty i loved it let's see okay that is better so that is finished with the the miracle stuff i do sometimes is put lip balm on my lips first and then do the rest of my makeup and then let like rub off the vaseline which i'm using vaseline rosy yeah rosy lips lip therapy i can get you can get this at target um and cvs because i think walgreens because they've been lately selling them in like two packs uh, and I know Dollar Tree they're selling the tube ones like you like a lip balm tube I, I've had that before I like this one way more than the little tube thingy but I that depends on you guys I so that's what I prefer but this is like my everyday lip balm I use I do have other lip balms they're in here they're tinted lip balms bro so this is a lip balm this is like a tint so there's that then i have my cute giggy bear lip balms i love these i got these in the tiktok shop they're only like two dollars but they're really good two of them has a scent and one to me i can't really smell the other two are grape and strawberry then i have this periberry glowing balm i love this color very much then i have my roman d moth whip it's more of a cool tone but I put a little bit on my lips. It's really good. I love it. And I love the scent of it. And then lastly is the Crim Shops BT21 Cookie and Koya. His, I think, is Aikai Berry and he's Rose. So, yeah. I want to get Mom because I love grape. I want to get others just to see what their scents are. But those are the other lip balms. I rarely use these because I want to, like, keep them longer. I know I have to use them. So, yeah. And lip therapy mask overnight is the crim shops i would have got me a laneige but i i wanted to try this first because i am a crim shop fan so i do like some things from crim shop crim shop okay let's see where should we start with makeup <laughs> okay all right let me see i'm gonna pull out my brushes i do got some perfumes too in there so these are my brushes these are for like blush and like a face mask to rub on and then these are like for my eyes, the black ones. I did got perfumes in here. I have the Burberry Goddess, which I rarely use. I do love the smell, so that's why I rarely use it. And I have this Be Paris um, Blueberry. It reminds me of grape and blueberry. I got this from Dollar Tree. They do have a strawberry one if you're interested. But you have to find them in your local uh, Dollar Tree because everyone's like different. And okay got my eyeshadow palettes so i'm gonna pick like which one always my to go to's let me just talk about my to go to um eyeshadow palettes i'm gonna put this one over here that one's like a new eyeshadow palette i've just gotten oh my god everything's a mess in here okay okay so let's do let's do our my to go to so this is my to go to it's the maybelline nudes of new york i love this eyeshadow powder i bought this like 
three years ago, I think, or three years, yeah, three, two years, two years, three years, whatever. Then, this is another one. I love this one. I know you can't see it, but I love this one. I love it so much. Hey, me. Hey, me. <laughs> but I love this one so much. And then I have Flower Nose. I have two of these. These are not PR. These I got from a TikTok shop. Um, this one I got at Ulta. It was on the clearance rack for only $7.50. So, yeah. I bought these for 23 bucks together. Like, yeah. Because they were on sale. This is like the strawberry one. She really, I don't, I do sometimes go to this one if I want more of a pinker look. But I'm a warm tone, so I tend to go more to the white one. Because I love like nude beigey colors for me. Because I'm more of a warm tone. And then last eyeshadow palette but hold on this is a little eyeshadow too it's a mauve color it's the color pop super shock shadow not in the shade not too much so yeah and then lastly is my recent new one it's the what's this one this is called oh god i'm confused it's called the profusion i put their labels on here but i can remove it it's the profusion love struck don't mind the big cuddles thing of it it was like that but this I got on sale for 10 bucks at Walmart. Because <laughs> why not? It's so pretty. I've wanted a Profusion eyeshadow palette. This is what it looks like. They're very pretty. Um, I haven't really used much of like a lot of them. So it still like looks brand new. Because I don't go to this palette as much. I should because I do have some nude colors and pinks. But I have to... Like I... I don't know, I tend to stick with my warm tone colors, but sometimes I will go to my cool tones, even though I'm not a cool tone, I'm a warm tone girly, so, yeah. Then, I have highlighter, I have three, hold on, and then I have NYX's Jumbo, it's the one that you can twist, I have it in Vanilla Ice Cream, Blue Meringue, and Blueberry Muffin, I want to get the shade Flan, because I feel like, it's, Flan is so pretty, I... Well, I, but I have those three. Blush, I really use these. They're from Timo, but hold up, yeah. They're kind of an odd. They're an ombre? Hold up. Got this one. She's cute, like, she's alright because she's more of a cool tone. I tend to go to this one sometimes. Sometimes, not all the time. Because she, they're two of my f first two blushes, actually. Hold up. This one doesn't want to open. Why? Hold up. I do not want to open. Oh well. She doesn't want to open. Then my third is my ColourPop. She is very... She's very pretty. Very pretty. This is in the shade... This is the ColourPop Pressed Powder Blush Pearlize in the shade Cosmopolitan, I guess. But that's what this one is. This one I got at Target with this one too. These two were it from Target. I'm like, forgot. I need to say that. See, I have another crumb shop. I had a chimney one, but the like eyeshadow thing like broke into pieces, so I have to get another chimney. Um, but I have um, Mong in the grape. I love purple, so I, of course, had to get this one. Now, I think this one, yeah, this one's very easy. As you can tell, I have used it. It's so gorgeous. I love it. I love it so much. Okay, that was eyeshadow. That was from Ulta, so yeah. This one is Lily by Red. This was in, I think, the shade number five. It's in Korean. I think it's in Marcella. So, I think it's Marcella. This one goes well with my skin tone. Like, I love it. I want to try a beige blush to see how that goes. And a purple blush. <laughs> Even though purple is, like, more of a cold tone. But this darn blush, this one, does not want to open. This one just does not want to open. It took today. Like, what the heck? <sighs> okay, guys, I'm sorry. But this one doesn't want to open. I need something to open this. Hold on. Uh, hold up. I'm trying to find something to open with this. I'll use this because I don't know why. I don't know why this is not. What, there you go. This one doesn't open. This is more of a. Hold up. This is more of like the beige with the pink. This is what it looks like. It's cute. It is cute. I have more of a round face, so I like, try to figure out how to use this one more than the other one so yeah and then the last two items are eyeliners I have both these are both by Essence and my mascara I don't know where my mascara is Oops. 
Um, this one's Essence Lash Princess in black, and this is the Essence Stay and Play Gel in black as well. I don't know. Oh my god, where is my Bye Bye Pandas? Oh no. Oh well, we probably won't use mascara today. I don't feel like using mascara. I feel like using more of eyeshadow and blush. Um, but I, my mascara is Essence Bye Bye Plant. Bye Bye Plant Pandas. So, yeah. I was looking for it, but I still can't find it. Maybe it's in one of my bags somewhere. Somewhere doing something. Oh, wait. Maybe it's in my little pink pouch. I got this from a beauty shop, so. Um, let me feel. And no, because I have face masks in here. I used to carry my lip products in here, but then I decided to move my, hold up, my lip balms in here. Um. And I have a flask dish driver and my AirPods that can all fit in this little BMO pouch. I got this from Hot Topic. I got him on sale. He's BMO. I always thought it was a he, but he's gender neutral. BMO's been gender neutral, so I as you can tell I love BMO. But Marceline is my favorite character, so gotta remember that. <laughs> I wish they would have more of Marceline, so yeah. I'm looking at my bag because I know I have some things in here. And my key. Oh, that's that's just oh yeah. Clear lip gloss. Smells like caramel. Get get it from the uh, Dollar Tree. It's really good. Love it. It's just a pink and clear like lip gloss. I'm gonna look in here because I put pencils. Okay, no, but my lip products are in here. I have two things of Maybelline. They're the Alte Ultra Matte color. I got one in more rust, so this is this one, more rust, and this one's more top. Yes. I love these types of red and browns. Then I have three things of para para. Hold up. Okay, para para. It's this one, it's like corally, and then I have number two, one. This one's good brick, and I have number two, the celeb deep rose. So I have these. I love para para so much. <laughs> Sponsor me. I'm just joking. <laughs> And then lastly, I have this LA Colors Nude Glow. I finally found O oh, Teddy. I followed this girl named Marissa Marie. I was like, I gotta find O oh, Teddy, like, come on. And then lastly, I have this lip pencils. This is, um, hold on, let me show you guys. I do own these two, two things. So my family. Um, I own these. I own, like, these. I remember the stickers. Don't mind me. I tend to do that. I own these, uh, these are like the NYX Shine Loud. This one's in the shade Life Goals. And then the lip pencil is shade Automation. Because they showed these two were like together. So I was like, ooh, I want to try. But it doesn't look good on me. But I'm still keeping them. Because why not? And then I have the O Espresso. I love this lip pencil shade. And the last one I have is the NYX. This one looks terrible. As you can tell, it looks terrible. But this is the NYX. Uh, I think this is ma yeah, Magic Maker. I'm still trying to figure out how do I use this because every time I use it, I apply the color, like this part first, let it dry, then I apply it again, let it dry, and then I put the gloss on, and then it like everything runs down. So I'm like, I don't know how <laughs> to use those. Like, somebody help me. But yeah, I still can't find my mascara. Like, where did it go? I love that mascara so much. And sorry if I'm getting too close to the camera. Don't mind that. Oh, there it is. Guys, I thought it missing. It's literally been right here. This is my mascara. This is my favorite mascara ever. This is actually my first mascara, and I love it. Doesn't irritate me. Doesn't make my eyes cry. No weird eye um, like things or lesions or stuff like that. I love it. I try to make sure when I buy makeup that it has safe ingredients for me like nothing wrong because i know some people get allergic to Coverbrow or maybelline or like um, revlon some people get, sometimes get allergic to essence not as much but the other brands i mentioned they a lot of people do get allergic i'm like whoa um i don't use mary Kay at all like no why it seems like old women's makeup no no me no hatred no hatred if you're a mary Kay lover ava i mean avon's got pretty 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 stuff i have to say i do have to agree that um because as a kid my mom used to have the avon catalog and we would, like looked through it and, like there's they have pretty makeup i have to say they have cute things like for kids like they used to sell dolls i actually have a doll of one of their catalogs back in the day i have sheila um but um yeah but mary Kay makeup 
No, thank you. Um, if you like it, that do you, that do you. Don't come no hate at me. No hate at me. But I love is Peripera. I want to try Clio because that's like very popular recently. And like cushion foundation. I don't wear foundation. I just wear my skincare products and SPF like sunscreen and just go. And I might put some blush and eyeshadow. But recently, lately, I haven't been wearing no makeup at all because the weather is very hot, humid. I just don't feel like doing nothing at all with my face. Maybe put a little bit of lip balm and just go. That's it. That is it. So today, I feel like doing... I want to do eyeshadow first, but I want to use her because... I actually want to use Love Struck, but like, I can't use all my palettes. I can't, but... Hold on, let me show you. I didn't really show you this. I just showed you the cover of it, but... So you can tell, I use a lot of it. <laughs> I love this one. They used to have a peach one. I think it's a peach highlight or something. It's like peaches. And um, I never bought it, but I wanted to. But I haven't seen it around lately. But it's so cute. I love this. Does it have no smells? No, nothing. It, it, it doesn't irritate me. So, yeah. I'm very careful when I do buy makeup. I don't want nothing happening um, to my face. So, yeah. I think let's start. Where am I? Am I forgetting something? Where is my... There they are. Hold up. Play back in. After I'm done with my like, makeup and stuff, I'm going to show you guys my fragrances. Some of them are actually brand new because of my either I was gifted them for my family and or I've recently bought a perfume. Because the main one I only have were like, like they're very little. But I actually sell one of my perfumes because they don't smell little me. It's, it's like the Burberry Her. She's, she's still good. But if someone wants her, please take her because, yeah, she don't really smell that good for me. But yeah, I'll show her that at the end. So, yeah. Um, let's do my baby. Let's do a, like a regular makeup look when I'm actually going out. Because I don't wear makeup when I'm home. No, why would I? I'm not those TikTokers that like wear makeup at home every day. Like, bro, no. So I sometimes do mix these two together. These two. So I'm going to go with a shade base because these are actually a bit lighter on me. Ooh, a little bit lighter on me, but that's okay. I have one that actually, missed, I think two shades that actually match my skin tone better. But Explore matches my skin tone the best. So you wouldn't even realize that I'm wearing eyeshadow if I'm wearing Explore. So I know I think I picked the wrong brush, but I don't care. Like, heck yeah. It's very simple how I do it. I just like go. I go with the flow. Sometimes I don't even. Sometimes I do look at like makeup videos, like girls do like eyeshadow, like a tutorial. But I tend to mess up and not be that good at it. But like I don't really care. Hold on. Shouldn't tilt my head. Like I was trying to look at a tutorial of like eyeliner because I am terrible at doing the eyeliner. I'm new to this, okay? I'm new to eyeliner, but like I'm terrible. Like one's bad, like one's bad, so one side and the other is looks chicken scratch. You're like, what the heck am I even doing with eyeliner? Like, see, kind of make mine dramatic. This is more rounded, but I'm gonna put more like. Uh, I might put more at the crease because, yeah. Um, I'm a girly who tends to want glitter always on my face. Well, like glitter on my eyes, eyelids. <laughs> so, yeah, I do do that. Um, usually I would do the dark chocolate base. I always think of this as chocolate, but they're actually for the Ballet Salon series. I actually love that series. I kind of hate. Like, I messed up. Like, I kind of destroyed hold up, the palette a bit. Especially where the dark chocolate is. So, it doesn't have that cool tux look. Okay. Let's see. I want to think about putting more of a dramatic chocolate. Like, right about here. I don't know. Oh, something fell away in my eye. Aho. Aho. What the heck? I get so dramatic. I swear. <laughs> Got to my head up. Uh, 
Let's see. I'm gonna do it more like that. Like it's more, you know, pretty. If I let it just swing out on its own. God, I feel like so wet in my eyeball. Okay. Wait, don't shut it. Well, I have to, but anyways. I usually use my finger to get the glitter, but sometimes I use the brush. I'm trying to decide if I should do a clear translucent or the more of a peach. I'm thinking about doing more of a peachy color. So I wanna use more of a no, no, I don't use that brush. I rather use this brush because it spreads faster. I would use my finger, but come here, come on, give me, give me more glitter, give me more glitter, give me so much glitter that I don't even, you know. Uh, where did the glitter go? <laughs> where did the glitter go? Hold on. See, that's why I use my fingers. You know what? I'm gonna use my fingers. Cause I think doing it like this is way better for me. And I did I spread out on my finger like that, and then this is like basic makeup style that I do. I'm not that shamancy shamancy, like a pro makeup artist. Like no, no. But that's what it looks like. I do it more like that. So, it'd be cool to do the ombre like look that I see other girls do. I love that so much. Next thing is, see, I decided to put mascara on. So, yeah. Oh, dang. It's like a like sign on me. Hold on. I haven't even used you in long. So, uh, I don't ever do my bottom lashes, I always do my top. I'm terrible doing the bottom lashes. So I'm always afraid it's gonna get on the skin, on, on like my eyelid. So, yeah. And then, hold on. I think I should change the, there you go. The brightness, better. Sometimes I do get glitter on my cheek from the eyeshadow. Sometimes, not all the time. I'm very gentle with these eyelashes. Like, whoa. Why am I so gentle? Okay. Oopsie. I made a boo boo. It's right. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. Blush. I'm thinking about using my Zella because I use her the most. Even though she doesn't look like she's been used. <laughs> but I do because I think she's like the perfect skin tone for me perfect one for me Lily by Red okay I tend to go up I don't know how this would look okay that's my brush I was like why does she smell like lemons or something What just happened? Why do I look like a... Never mind, let's just... Okay, hold on. Hold on. I... I ah, boo boo boo. I made a mistake. Sometimes I do make a mistake with blush. Like, that's a bit better than a whole huge... I don't know what to say. Circle, but... I'm just gonna blush and I just blend it in the skin. I'll just do this. Oh, my nose. Oh, get this thing on my nose. Oh no. I'm supposed to take away my nose. A bit of the brush hair. I made a terrible mistake on the blush. Ugh. Ugh, why me? I look like a look like sunburn got me. I feel still calm down. Oh, actually, I'm gonna do it this way. Okay. 
Okay, I think it looks a little bit better because we've got most of the pink out. Oh well. Okay, I'll clean this. I, every time when I do makeup, I always clean my brushes. Like, I literally wash them. Next thing is to do this one. I usually put it on my nose. I would put it on my cheeks, too. I just rub it in like that. That's what I do. Nothing like crazy. And then right here at my cheeks. Don't do anything crazy. Don't do anything crazy. Like the blush. Ooh. Ooh, it's gotten pink on it. So. Give it a blow. Sometimes I don't ever put highlighter on my cheek. But today I am because I have people do it. I'm like, I want to do it. Get that glow. Should I should. I don't know. Oh, not this brush. Not that one. This one. Okay. Let's see. How does it? A little bit better. Hold on. I'm just a little bit. Shine. I am so terrible. I'm still learning. Don't judge me. I'm still learning. <laughs> Especially with the blush place. Oh my goodness. Like, I am terrible. Last thing I did one time. Let's put this on right here. Like, as a darker glitter. Even though. There you go. I do sometimes use the white vanilla, the vanilla one on top, but I just don't do it like that. Blue Ray Muffin I use more with like different colors. Like if I'm doing a color eyeshadow look, yeah. But today I'm not, so yeah. Okay. I don't have a tissue, but I use a cotton round to remove the lip balm. Oh, definitely made my lips pink. Okay. Crash that. Okay. Another lip color I'm going to use. I would use Oketty with my lip. Oh, that's eye that's eyeliner. We're not going to do eyeliner today because I don't want to embarrass myself and show you how terrible I am with my eyeliner. Ow. I'm trying to find my lip pencil. Where did I even put it? Oh my gosh. Oh, there it is. It's too bad. false. Sometimes, hold up. Oh, sometimes I'm on my nose. Crazy. Then I go ahead and blend out, blend it out, like fade it. And then, ah. Yep, and then I go ahead and use O-Teddy. Oh, it looks like a cookie. Oh my god. Don't mind how light this is. <laughs> Don't mind. Oh. Okay. Oh, I love it, but I know it's a little bit lighter on me, but that's okay. That's okay. I used to have a, the Maybelline Raw Chocolate 560, but then it melted in my bag. I'm like, ooh, I gotta throw it away. But, yeah. Yeah. 
this is what it looks like i'm gonna go ahead and take this off so that don't have to stay on my hair anymore got the hold on my hair is a bit crazy today it's acting like it wants to frizz on me on the top of my head but that's fine um the blush it went down i'm kind of proud the this is a bit bigger than this but the side but terrible so let's go ahead with talking about fragrances these are my body mist uh bath and body works i have is the dark kiss i love it i love japanese cherry blossom i've loved japanese cherry blossom since high school so i always love smelling this i don't spray as much because she's one of my favorites and then i have the ballet nights it's perfect for winter i know that these are all gifted from my mom thanks mom um super happy with those and then the one i did buy is this cute tree hut tropic glow it's a fragrance shower wet mist it gives you glitter solid so marissa marie's video i'm like i gotta get that i love i love tree hut i've used one product which was the matcha uh body scrub and then i've used not this one i've used it a few times but still looks like on top and i have hold on i have three more i have my jimmy Choo. i bought this 2021 christmas i love this one it's just jimmy choo jimmy choo i think all they perform it smells really good it's the 0 0.5 because i don't really use it much but now i'm at the half <laughs> then i have is the bur yeah burberry rose i bought this at marshall's it was like 50 bucks 52 bucks for this i'm glad it's that price it does seem to fade away quick for me but i do love the smell of it love it a lot and then lastly is my Sol de Janeiro 62 she's my go-to every time when I'm going to do a daily errand so I do just spray that on and just go I love this one I actually want to do 15 I actually want to get 59 but I'll wait oh because I gotta go in the store and smell it I haven't yet and then the perfume that I am selling let me go get that real quick it's this one She's, I bought these two together at Christmas time in 2021, and I've used this since 2021, but then I stopped because she started not smelling good on me. Like, it smelled like cat pee pee. I'm like, is this the peony or something? But when you, hold up, but when you smell it, it doesn't smell like that. Like, it smells like floral and like a cloud i don't know what it is maybe it's with my body or something i don't know but i always spray around my neck it almost got near my hair but near my neck but i'm selling her for like 85 bucks she's like this half i would sell it at 75 but 85 85 yeah 85 is good i'm selling on macari it'll be linked on my page under macari so and poshmark if you prefer poshmark yeah either one so that's the one i'm selling she's like gotta go she's gotta leave she gotta go out of ghost you know <laughs> But for me, I I tend to pair these two together. So, yes. So I usually spray her, I spray this one on my arms. So, I'm gonna spray on my hands too because I wanna show you how this looks on me. I'm gonna let it dry a bit. Oh, it smells so good. I love it. And then my Sole Janeiro, I usually, like, oh, I sprayed it on my shirt. <gasps> it's supposed to go on the shirt like that. Anyways, so since it's drying, I don't know. <sighs> let it dry, let it dry. It smells really good. I love the smell of it. It smells so good. Did I make a boo boo? Oh, yeah, I made a boo boo. There you go. Oh, it's my finger. So maybe you can't see it, maybe you can. It has little gold shimmers. Where is it? Oh. Hold on. Let me, let me, you know what? I'm gonna spray on my hand again. My little. There you go. I'm gonna like do it like this. I'm gonna spread it on my hand and see. Now, you can't see it, but. Let's see. Hold 
Like, I see little gold sparkles on me. So, yeah. And it's like only 10 bucks. And I got this at Alta, so. Yes. That is it. I use this one when I'm, like, gonna go somewhere nice. It reminds me of chocolate and raspberries. I don't know why, but it's actually more of a... What's the notes on this? It has black raspberry, burgundy rose, bergamot, instant, dark vanilla bean, and plum musk. Oh. Yeah, I always forget. I know a lot of people have been giving her hate, but I love my Japanese cherry blossom. But I know it's a Bath and Body Works this year. Like, their perfumes are much more stronger than before. I'm like, what did y'all put in the perfume? So, everything will be linked on my page of what I've used. I am going to link all the Soul Me products that I used. Um, because I know I have added those in my description. Um, of course I'm going to link all the makeup that I own too. Some of these I bought at Amazon. Some of these I have bought on at Ulta. And I bought these at Target along with the color props. So I'll be able to link those. And in Dollar Tree, I'll mention the ones from Dollar Tree because why not? So yeah, I hope you enjoyed my video of my skincare and makeup routine. I'm not a pro, but <laughs> at least this was fun doing. Have a nice day. I'll be